Today on Living by Design, it's the 2021 Harvest Girls International Incorporated If the Shoe Fits White Party. And I would like to start this off with this one thing that I wrote for the girls. This is our affirmation. I am fearfully and wonderfully made. I can do anything that I say. I can set goals and dream dreams. With God, it's possible to do all things. I am not weak, I am strong. I persevere through it all. Challenges, economy, and adversity will not hold me back. I'm a child of God, so I never suffer lack. I have a heart of pure gold, so I step out into the world because I am bold. I have the power to dream, to be the best that I can be. I can do anything and I will succeed because I believe in me. Living by Design with host Kathy Holloway Hill. Kathy is a strong, powerful voice. She entertains, informs, and inspires her audiences everywhere she goes. Holloway Hill and welcome to the Living by Design show. I am so pumped and so excited because we are doing a celebration today. We are celebrating the 2021 If the Shoe Fits White Party for Harvest Girls International. And I have a very special co-host who is going to be joining me today and you know this individual because he is a legend in the media world and his name is Mr. Tony Lamont. Welcome to Living by Design, Tony Lamont, as we celebrate this white party. Thank you. It is a pleasure to be a part of the white party once again. I know we've had an opportunity to do this amazing event several times and now to be able to do it virtually and co-hosting with you is such a pleasure. Absolutely. I, I couldn't have, have said I could not have said it better. So we are going to get started and get the party going and get the party started. And Harvest Girls International really wanted to make sure that we keep this tradition going and we keep it going in a very special way. And this year we're going to have a really fun virtual event where we're going to be celebrating and you're going to be, see, be able to see the journey of an organization that's designed to empower, impact, and educate women and young girls to becoming the highest level of themselves. No matter who you are or what you've been through, transformation begins with you. And Harvest Girls was founded in Indianapolis and it has transformed lives all over the world. So before we go any further, we have a brief clip from the founder and CEO of Harvest Girls International, Miss Chris Meadows. Greetings, everyone, and welcome to the Harvest Girls International 11th annual If the Shoe Fits White Party presentation. Hi, I'm founder and president of Harvest Girls International, Chris Meadows. I started this organization, oh, about 13 years ago when I myself was going through a trying time. I was trying to find my true identity. I was divorced. I was a single mom. And I just couldn't figure out what was going on in my life. So I did my work. And I decided that after I did my work, I wanted to present to other women that they too could overcome their challenges and, and diversities and adversities. And so in doing that, I came up with Harvest Girls International Incorporated based on the fact that Harvest Girls is a all women empowerment organization. That means all women all over the world. Every woman is a Harvest Girl. We are all women in the harvest and we are all over the world making our statements and doing our thing and overcoming our obstacles and doing everything that we need to do to survive. But we need to do it together and we need to lift one another up. And that's what Harvest Girls is all about. And not only lifting up others, uh, but lifting yourself up and then you too can lift up other people. It's not enough that we are successful within ourselves, but true success is helping others to become successful as well. 
Our model for Harvest Bros International is very simple. Achieving excellence, building character, and serving others. That's where we start, but that's not all. We empower women to celebrate the journey. It doesn't matter what has happened to you, what you've done and what you've been through. There is still a celebration in you. And everything that has happened to you, everything that you've experienced can be used to take you to the next level. See, it's about not standing in your story, but standing on your story, using that story as a platform to take others to a new level as well as yourself. And also we have the Power to Dream scholarships. We love this because this is a way we encourage the community starting young. We take young girls who are freshmen in college, just graduating high school, and we give them a scholarship to help support them in their books or maybe in their tuition. But that's not all. We have a mentoring program that goes along with that, that we help walk you through that whole journey if you choose for us to do so. The scholarships are given by you, the public, who help us to support these ladies. We're so excited this year that we're able to give five scholarships. And one scholarship is brand new because she is a doctoral program candidate and she too was once one of our scholarship recipients. So we are excited to give away continuing education scholarships and scholarships for those who are just starting college but it takes you and your support to do that. We can't do it alone. And then we have the All Girls Matter Self-Esteem Program. All Girls Matter, matter. yes, they do. And we say that because every girl has a purpose. Every girl has a platform and everything that she needs is inside of her. And so we have been dedicated to bringing that out and bringing that to the surface so that she can prosper and she can start at a very early age identifying herself as the powerful woman that she will become. And then we have our sister chapter, Wow Atlanta. We have a chapter in Atlanta called Wow Atlanta ran by Helen Chambers and that chapter caters to women 50 and over. And it has been running for about 10 years now. So we are in full operation thanks to you our listening audience, our public, people who support us. We have done amazing things over the last 13 years. And so we are excited to bring you this presentation today. And in this presentation, we want you to see the life, the breadth, the depth of Harvest Girls International and see our heart. And we pray that about, about at the end of this show that you will support us by going to www.harvestgirls.com. Let me leave you with this one thing. Never dilute yourself because someone can't take you at a hundred proof. You matter. You are authentic. You are purposeful and you are amazing. And I hope and pray that you will enjoy this show and knowing that your best is yet to come. Thank you, Chris. Let's now talk about the All Girls Matter Self-Esteem Academy. When Chris Meadows founded the All Girls Matter Self-Esteem Academy, the goal was to give all girls the same chance in life to build her self-esteem, design her goals, and to have the power to dream. Thus, the curriculum was born. Now, the Power to Dream curriculum is a 12-month module of lessons to teach young girls entrepreneurial skills, speech, critical thinking, self-esteem, time management, Harvest Girls International Incorporated has impacted lives of young girls ages 9 to 17 for 13 years. Let's take a look at some of the events they've sponsored. In spite of the pandemic, Harvest Girls found a way to keep the empowerment coming by shifting to online classes, which enabled Harvest Girls to reach even more girls worldwide. Harvest Girls even started shipping books, t-shirts, and other empowerment items to All Girls Matter Self-Esteem Academy attendees by utilizing the U.S. postal system, letting nothing stop them in expanding their reach to change lives. Excellent, Tony. Absolutely. You are right on with that. And I'm so excited to be here today with you and to celebrate this incredible event. Now, you all know that donations is what keeps Harvest Girls International going. So you see the email on your screen and we need you to go there and donate whatever you can give, whether it's a dollar, one dollar, 
$100 or $1,000, everything helps because we wanna keep this organization thriving and surviving. And we need them because our young girls' lives depend on it. So please make your donation right now. Tony, I don't know about you, but I am really enjoying myself. But we're gonna take a quick break and we'll be right back. Don't go anywhere. Hi, my name is Chris Meadows and I am founder and CEO of Harvest Girls International. Harvest Girls International is a women's empowerment organization. We empower women to celebrate the journey and we empower young girls ages 9 through 17 with the power to dream. I love what I do, I love this life because I'm living this life by design. There are women who have great positions of power in many fields. And those women didn't get there by being soft or timid. They had to go out and get what they wanted. They had to make their employees understand what they were saying. They had to be articulate. They had to be kind. And they also had to be forceful. That's quite a combination in this society because the society tends to pit us against each other in an unnatural competitive way. And then because compete in things that don't matter. Oh really, you're beautiful? Well, so am I. Oh really, you got great hair? Well, check mine out. Oh really, I love your shoes? Well, hey, I made these. You know, there's <laughs> about confidence. You don't have to step on someone to raise yourself up. We have to teach that for, to them from a very early age, that we stand on the shoulders of others, but we are not standing on the shoulders to peg them down. They're lifting us up. So it's very important that we really concentrate on how to get our girls to understand that competitive is not bad, but that it does not have to be hurtful. This whole mean girl syndrome that's going on and all the bullying online and all that stuff, mm -mm. no. Teach them that they can back away from being part of the problem. If you cannot be someone who is the leader in your school, or if you cannot be someone who is always going to be out there going, understand that every organization Every piece of community society has different levels of people that give different things. If there's someone in your school being bullied and you know they're being bullied, everybody knows they're being bullied. They probably even know why. But if you are that one girl who instead of bullying them, doesn't bully them and just says, hey, I think your blue hair is okay, or I like that outfit, I think it's cool that you're different, you don't have to be the one to save them, but you can be the one to be that one part of their day, that small part of their day where they didn't get hurt. Welcome back. I'm Kathy Holloway Hill. And I'm Tony Lamont. And we are your hosts for this celebration of If the Shoe Fits annual Harvest Girls International White Party. And we are enjoying the celebration and I hope you are too. Let's celebrate the journey, women's empowerment. The Harvest Girls Women's Empowerment has impacted and educated the women in the Indianapolis area and in Atlanta. Celebrate the Journey Women's Empowerment teaches women that nothing in life is wasted. Everything can be used to raise you to your higher self. Harvest Girls has hosted over 100 seminars, workshops, and community service projects for women. Harvest Girls empowers women that no matter what has happened to you and no matter what you've done, there is still a celebration in you. Featuring such events as financial literacy, overcoming setbacks, self-worth, self-leadership, girls' night out, just to name a few. All right, let's keep the party going. Take it away, Tony. Thanks a lot, Kathy. Harvest Girls International Incorporated has also extended its chapter to WOW Atlanta. Now, WOW Atlanta is under the umbrella of Harvest Girls International Incorporated, and it's under the direction of Helen Chambers, once a resident of Indianapolis and now moved to Atlanta, Georgia. Now, Helen served on the board of Harvest Girls International upon conception and remains the regional vice president of Harvest Girls International Incorporated. WOW Atlanta empowers women 50 years old and up. Okay, I am going to keep reminding you about donations. This is what keeps the Harvest Girls International organization going. They need to thrive. And it's our responsibility as a community to make sure that happens. So go to this website and donate. All right, If the Shoe Fits White Party fundraising event. Harvest Girls International 
presented if the shoe fits white party fundraising event. Now, Harvest Girls International presented if the shoe fits white party fundraising in 2010. Now, this was an event designed to fit the needs of the community. Whether you've been through anything or can identify with the need, then you can help. Then the Power to Dream College Scholarship Award was conceived, giving college scholarships to graduating female high school seniors and continuing education females. The fundraising was also sponsored the All Girls Matter Self-Esteem Program and Community Service Projects. Harvest Girls has given over 50 college scholarships. Harvest Girls has given over 700 packets since their existence to their community service projects, to homeless shelters, families, family shelters, and various organizations. The White Party fundraising event is an elegant affair that includes a three course dinner, awards, presentations, there are community service awards, the president's award, and the scholarship awards. And then it's time to party. Entertainment has been some of the best. Angel Taylor of Trinity 57. Ain't no way for me to love, love you if you want. Winner of the Apollo Theater Amateur Night and background singer for the recording artist Lettucey. The event also includes a silent auction with some incredibly awesome prizes. Oh my goodness, Tony. I don't know about you, but this is so inspiring and so motivating for me. Absolutely it is. And you know what is really important about this whole process is not only is it a party, but it's a fundraiser, but not only a fundraiser, we're awarding the individuals who have made a difference in the lives of young women and women all throughout this uh, Indianapolis area and really around the country. We are going to take another quick break from our celebration and our fun, but don't you go anywhere because we still have a lot of partying to do. We'll be right back. I thank you for deciding to spend this evening with Harvest Girls International Incorporated. We are an organization that, that we empower young girls ages 9 through 17 and women with the Power to Dream self-esteem program for the girls and celebrate the journey for the women. This is such a uh, wonderful thing for me tonight. Uh, I believe, I do believe, that you do not let your struggles become your shackles. As tonight, I could have let this struggle become my shackle uh, wearing this boot. But I made up my mind a long time ago that if it didn't kill me, it would make me stronger. And so that's where I put my young girls and where I put the women. 
in their strength and their power. I believe that everything that we have is on the inside of us. And it doesn't matter what we go through or what it looks like. We have everything we need on the inside. It takes just as much faith to be negative as it does to be positive. That same energy you give to negativity, you can give to positivity. But here's the difference, the choice is yours. So tonight we choose power. Tonight we choose strength. Welcome back, I'm Kathy Holloway Hill and my co-host. Tony Dumont, you know what, Kathy, I'm gonna say this before we get into our next award, which is a very important award. This virtual experience, we've been for the last several years in various locations, but what's amazing to me is this is, this feels good too. It really does. I mean, it's not the new norm, but it's the essential norm and we're doing it. And I'm glad Chris and, and, and her staff and everybody involved decided to go ahead and continue doing this. So kudos to her and everybody else. I uh, couldn't agree. Couldn't agree more, Tony. Very well said. And yes, from me too, kudos to Chris, your staff, Wow Atlanta, everyone associated with Harvest Girls International. It is my honor to be here tonight. So now it's time for the 2021 Harvest Girls International Awards. And the first one coming up is the 2021 Harvest Girls International Community Service Award. Now this year's Harvest Girls International Incorporated Community Service Award goes to PJ Wesson. PJ is the owner of Personology. She has supported Harvest Girls International with her generous partnerships, supporting the Harvest Girls International Purse Project, where women donated purses to other women in shelters and placing essential need items inside along with a special empowerment note written by each woman. She has consistently donated items for the White Party Auction, Harvest Girls' Favorite Things, You Are, My Sister, and more. So, let's talk about the 2021 Harvest Girls International President's Award. The Harvest Girls International President's Award is given to individuals who directly support Harvest Girls International in many ways. The award is given by the president herself, Chris Meadows, to show appreciation for the impact, dedication, and the underlying support this individual has supplied to Harvest Girls International. This year's 2021 Harvest Girls President Award goes to Mr. and Mrs. Greg and Wesleyan Waities. Congratulations to Mr. and Mrs. Greg and Wesleyan Waities. The Power to Dream 2021 Scholarship recipients now, the Power to Dream Scholarship was designed to provide college books or tuition support for first-time female college students and continuing education female students. Now, this year, for the first time, we'll be expanding our reach and awarding a college scholarship on behalf of our Atlanta, Georgia chapter, WOW Atlanta Executive Director, Helen Chambers. Our first recipient is Isaiah Adams of Atlanta, Georgia for $1,200 and will be attending Emory University. Congratulations. Our next recipient is Anaya Harris from Indianapolis. She will be receiving $1,000 attending Indiana University in Bloomington. Our next recipient is Kiana Jackson of Avon, Indiana, receiving $750 attending Butler University. And our next recipient is Tamia Stovall, from Cincinnati, Ohio, and she will be receiving $500 attending the Christ College of Nursing and Health Sciences in Ohio. Our next recipient is Kirsten Hawkins of Indianapolis, Indiana, winning $500 enrolled in doctoral program at the Walden University, Indianapolis. And we wanna give a special shout out and a special thank you to the scholarship committee, Josh Meadows, chairperson, Janice Crawford, Rochelle Hardeman Bible, and Jaleesa Coffee. We also want to thank our Harvest Girls International 2021 sponsors, Dr. and Mrs. Tom and Beverly Benjamin, Greg and Westland Waities, the Children's Bureau, Gwendolyn Hardeman, Dr. Karen Rodman, Eric and Cynthia Newman of the Newman Group, Primerica, this has been incredible, Tony. Harvest Girls International would like to thank everyone who donated, whether it was via your website or your social media Facebook page. 
And this is really what's going to help us and help Harvest Girls to continue with these incredible events, whether they're virtual or whether they're in person. So we want you to go to the, the website and the email address on your screen to make sure that you get your donations in. It's very, very important. It means a lot to us and it definitely means a lot to Harvest Girls. So please make sure you do that. I can't agree with you more, Kathy, how important it is for folks to make the donation. It's essential for everyone to be a part of this. You may not be a part of the organization, but you can change the organization with your donation. And what I want you to do is please donate to Harvest Girls International Incorporated at harvestgirls.com. That's how you get it done. And that's how we change lives. Amen, Tony. Couldn't have said it better. And it's on your screen. So just in case you're unsure, it's right there on your screen. We want you to go donate. We started out the show asking for donations and we're going to end the show asking for donations because that's what the If the Shoe Fits White Party by Harvest Girls International is all about. It's about helping the community and you, the community, can help us by continuing to keep this incredible organization going. Tony, it's been a pleasure. You have been the best co-host. I had so much fun with you and I really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it too. Make sure you make those donations, folks. It's going to change a lot of young ladies' lives. Amen. Amen. We thank you for joining us for this incredible, empowering episode of the Living by Design show. And we'll see you same time next week with another empowering episode. Good night, everyone.